Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Good morning, my lovely students. Today, inshallah, I will teach you super goal four for the second intermediate grade in the second semester. So, I want all of you to open your book first of all on page 28. Today, inshallah, we will take a grammar. Look what do we have here. We have here future with going uh, uh, future with be going to so you use uh, be going to to talk about something in the future or to talk about plans as you can see here plan okay look what do we have here affirmative and negative look here I am going to travel to the Jordan so I am thinking in the future look here in the future I am talking about the future so I will I will say I am going Negative, I am not. We just add not. I am not going to visit Petra. Okay? Question, we will just switch. Are you going to travel to Jordan? Yes, I am. No, I am not. So, I use going to when I want to talk about the future, like tomorrow. Information questions. So, we have here WH questions. What? We use what when we want to ask about things. What are you going to do in your vacation? I am going to travel to Africa. Okay. When? I use when when I want to talk about time. Time. When is he going to leave? He is going to leave next week. Okay. About time. Period. Okay. Which? When I ask about which, I ask about which exactly. So, if you have a lot of things, for example, you have Abha, uh, Jazan. Uh, Mecca. So I ask you which countries. So you will say, for example, Abha. Just one. So I use which when I have many when I have many different choices, and I want you to tell me which exactly you want. Which countries is he going to visit? He is going to visit Tunisia and Morocco. How? How are you going to go? So I use how when I want to ask about the way. Describe it to me. How? Describe it the way. So you will say, I we are going to buy plane. Okay. Where? I use where when I wanted to ask about a place. Okay. Place. Where are? Where? Uh, where am I going to stay? You are going to stay in the first hotel. Who? I use who when I want to talk about. Let's see. Uh, someone or person or it's like a people okay who is going to travel with them they are going to travel with their friends how long when I ask about how long it's uh, you you will tell me the period so it will take how my uh, how many days it will take for example two days four days one month and so on how long are you going to stay they are going to stay for a month okay look what do we have here Add the questions word, match the questions and the answers. We have a here six questions and we have a here six answers. Look here. How are you going, uh, how are they going to travel? So I ask about the way. See, they are going to take a pass. They are going to take a pass. What is uh, he going uh, to do when they arrive? It will be if he is going to rest. Who are, uh, who are they going to write to? Who? To their parents, to their family. Where? Where are you going to stay? At the place? In a beautiful hotel. When are you going to get there? You are going to travel uh, to arrive in the morning. Okay, my lovely students, let's now move to the second page. Here. Listening, okay? Then after that, we have a listening. Listen to three people talking about their vacations, plans, mark the boxes. So we have a here six, uh, six ideas and we have a here three people. We have Andy, Rod and Sam. Who is going to travel to another country? Who is going to climb a mountain? 
who is going to feed, to fish, who is going to help on a farm, who is going to okay, who is going to see wild animals. So we will listen, and uh, after we listen, so we will check according to that uh, according to the audio. So are you ready? Very good. So let's start. Page 29, 4, listening. Listen to the three people talking about their vacation plans. Mark the boxes. Andy, I'm going to do something really different this year for vacation. I'm going to fly to Santiago, Chile. Then I'm going to take a boat all the way down to Patagonia. That's at the bottom of South America. There, I'm going to see the glaciers. These large areas of ice are going to be magnificent to see. Then I'm going to stay in a hotel in a nature preserve called Torres del Paine. I'm going to see animals in their natural environment. For example, there are many guanacos in this area. These animals look a little like camels, and they're in the same family as the llama, but they're smaller. It's going to be a thrilling experience. I can't wait. Rod. I'm going to visit my friends in Switzerland. They live in a small town in the Alps. The town is a ski resort, and it's usually crowded. We're going to go mountain climbing and skiing. I think it's going to be really exciting. I'm looking forward to this vacation and going to another country. Sam. Well, I'm not going to travel. I'm going to spend my vacation right here. My uncle has a small farm in the country near a beautiful river. It's really peaceful and quiet there. I'm going to fish, help with farm chores, pick vegetables, and just relax. Okay, my lovely students. Who is going to travel in another country? It will be Andy and Rod. Who is going to climb mountain? Of course, Rod. Who is going to fish? Sam. Who is going to help on farm? Also, Sam. Who is going to ski? It will be Rod. Who is going to see wild animals? It will be Andy. Then let's what do we have for here. Then we will take a conversation. As you can see here, my lovely students. So first of all, what can you see? very good you can see uh let's see we can see here beautiful places right like uh, nature forests and look here i think uh it is a winter here but here i think it is um let's see like um maybe summer maybe it could be okay we have a here agent and omar so we have a two characters um, we have uh, here two blue phrases, two blue phrases with their meanings. I, I will now turn on the audio. So I want you to listen and for all, first of all, okay, I will read it. I will read it. So I want you to listen to me and follow. So what kind of vacations are you looking for? I am looking for a vacation in an exotic and exciting place. I love to meet people and learn about new cultures. And how about India? Omar, it is too crowded. I don't like Indian food. Do you like nature? This is a nature. We have a local um, a, a ecological tours in Costa, uh, Costa Rica rainforest you can stay in a treetop resort it is unique uh, jungle experience you are going to love it i am uh, aller uh, allergic to moss uh, mosquitoes why do you why don't you go to the alps you will experience french swiss italian and german cultures Actually, I am. I want a place that is isn't full of tourists. Somewhere of 
uh, of the PTN tra uh, trick. Okay, we have right here actually. Actually, it means used to introduce an opposing idea. So if you want to express your idea and you don't agree with the other side, you will say, mm, okay, actually, I don't like that. It means like, in fact, of the PTN trick not visited by many uh, tourists. So you just want a few people. A few people. Look what do we have here about conversation. Why doesn't Umar want to go to India? Why? Why? Because actually Umar doesn't want to go because it is too crowded. And he doesn't like the food. Okay. As you can see here, it is a bit too crowded and I don't like the Indian food. What is wrong with Costa Rica? So, as you can see here. Because he is, as you can see, he is allergic to most courts. Okay, very good. Number three, what kind of a place is Umar looking for? So he is looking for uh, a place that it doesn't have many people. Okay, just a few people. Okay, my lovely students, actually we are.